Welcome to the NatFL channel. The Miami Dolphins' longtime running game of musical chairs in their offensive backfield continues into the third consecutive season for the Chris Greer Brian Flores, with the running game looking to fortify the team's identity on offense. But that identity will only take the Dolphins as far as their backs can carry them in the offensive backfield, and the unfortunate reality for Miami is the team's running attack lacked pop in 2020. Yes. Once rookie tackle Robert Hunt was inserted into the lineup, Miami found a bit more room to run. Yes, once Miles Gaskin returned from a knee injury suffered against the Los Angeles Rams midway through the season, the backfield productivity was serviceable. But serviceable isn't exactly what the Dolphins seem to be going for in the running game. Miami wants to be able to dictate the pace of play in the trenches and simultaneously be able to pound the rock when needed to convert third and short opportunities to keep their offense on the field. Miami got very little, if any, of that in 2020. Which is what makes the latest reported agreement for the Dolphins in free agency such a predictable and acceptable move. Reports broke this afternoon that the Dolphins had come to terms with free agent running back Malcolm Brown, previously of the Los Angeles Rams. The Dolphins are signing former Rams RB Malcolm Brown, source said. He averaged more than four yards per rush in LA, now lands in Miami. Brown, a 5'11", 222-pound hammer, scored five touchdowns for the Rams in 2020 as a rotational back amid a crowded crop of runners, including 2019 third-round pick Daryl Henderson and 2020 second-round pick Cam Akers. This feels like a do-over of what the Dolphins aspired to acquire in Jordan Howard last offseason, but Brown has significantly less tread on his tires than Howard, a better injury history and comes at a significantly lower rate of salary. So while we'll have to wait and see what other investments come at running back, the Dolphins can rest easy knowing they have one back capable of charging between the tackles on third and short to grind out a tough yard. Odds are Miami isn't done investing here and that the Dolphins will be drafting a running back early in the 2021 NFL Draft. The question now is whether the team will attack a player of similar style or rather look for more of a speed dynamic to complement Brown's physicality as a runner. 